Callum, firstly, can you tell us what we're doing here today? Yeah, so we've got um, all the kids who have signed up at their local club, um, had a deal with the Suns that they get an 11 game membership here, so come watch the, the home game. So, um, yeah, it's good to have them down here and hopefully they enjoy the, enjoy the night. Always good for you to be able to give something back to the juniors? Yeah, definitely. No, it's, um, it's great to see the kids and I remember when I was a kid loving all the AFL superstars coming and, um, you know, having to kick around with them, so no, it's good. Your first game back on the weekend, obviously a disappointing result against GWS. Yeah, no, it was disappointing, but um, you know we thought our effort was there, and um, you know we've we've got some good guys pushing for spots, and um, you know there's a good morale around the team. So, yeah. What was the message to come from the reviews earlier today? Yeah, it was pretty positive. Um, you know, obviously it was a disappointing loss, but um, you know we've got to move on. You know, take a bit week by week, and um, you know. As I said, our effort, was, our effort was there and we just need to take that into next week and, and work on the things um, that we need to improve on. So, How's the uh, spirit amongst the group, as you touched on, there seems to be a lot of positiv positivity despite the results? Yeah, definitely. Now, the boys have... Uh, you know they're keeping their heads up. Obviously, we've got um, some injuries, but everyone's um, keeping in good stead, and all the boys are getting around each other. So uh, everyone's everyone's happy and, and feeling positive. You personally, 15 touches on the weekend. Do you feel like you're adjusting to the rigors of AFL football more? Yeah, definitely. I um, yeah, obviously, uh, I played 85% uh, last week, and um, you know that's the most game time I've played yet. And I've, I feel like I'm adjusting to it well. My body's adjusting to it, so yeah, very happy, and um, you know can only get better from here. So yeah. What do you see as your areas for improvement for the rest of the year? Um, yeah, again, just adjusting to the level now that I've kind of got a feel for it. Um, you know, starting to put bigger expectations on myself and going into the game more confident and um, you know not letting the coaches down and play my role. Tom Lynch has emerged as one of the best key forwards in the competition. What's it like playing alongside Lynchy? Yeah, really good. He's an amazing mentor and um, he's such such a good leader out in the field. So having him there really helps within the forward line and, and structures, especially being a young guy, it helps you fit in so much and um, yeah, you feel really confident with him out there. Adelaide this week at Metricon, what do the boys need to do to get a more competitive performance? I think, again, just, just work together, have that spirit there, that effort. Effort's always the number one thing, I think. Um, yeah, the, the boys are feeling pretty good and, and pretty confident, so um, as long as we bring that effort, I think, um, yeah, we'll be right. Thanks for your time. No worries. Thanks, guys.